All right, but it's gonna walk back to the channel. Welcome back to the Witcher. So we lost Vesemir last year. That's him burning. Rest in peace to Geralt's father figure. Zirel can harness immense amounts of the power. Why has no one taught her to control this? Actually, some did teach her. Clearly, to no effect. I'll glad. Haven't had a chance to talk. Thanks for your help. And for looking after Siri. You will thank me later. Now we must take Zirel from here, Haida. And then gather a greater force. Anyone, everyone we could count on came here to Kaer Morhen. Which is why we must seek the help of enemies. Magic is our best defense against the hunt. We need sorceresses. Arch mistresses of magic. You mean the Lodge? I don't want the Lodge anywhere near Siri. Just don't trust those women. What would you have us do instead? Fight alone and die a beautiful but pointless death? No, Geralt. By some miracle, we survived that fight, eking out a measly victory at enormous cost. No more guerrilla warfare. Time to face the enemy in open battle. I've made an agreement with the Emperor. In exchange for its help, the Lodge will be granted amnesty and find asylum in Nilfgaard. That will be our bargaining chip. Triss, I wish to leave today to find the sorceresses. Will you help me? Of course. Even got an idea where you could start. Damn it! Again you planned without even asking what I think. I've had enough of this. I won't be taken somewhere like a bundle. I will not sit and twiddle my thumbs. I am sick of waiting, sick of hiding. You can't expose yourself. Am I a banner to be held aloft and kept from the enemy? That's how you treat me. None of you has the courage to face this threat. Yet we must kill them. Or sooner or later we will all die. Better go after her. Wait, she needs time. We must let her resolve her grief on her own. Then we should start training as soon as possible. She must learn to control her abilities. This training really necessary? You saw what happened. She could be a greater threat than the hunt. Fine. We'll stay here a while longer, then join you and Triss in Novigrad. Meet at Dandelion's Inn. Come on, Yen. The sooner we leave, the better. See ya. Don't you see? Discouraged after a mere eight attempts? Sierra. How many times must I try? As many as it takes. But I'm not getting anywhere. Hmm. We shall return to this later. Didn't make it far first time out on the gauntlet, either. Geralt, please, not now. <sighs> By comparison, the gauntlet was a walk in the park. But that's not the point. What is? Avalach says nothing will come of this until I stop thinking about the battle. But at the moment, I find it impossible to fill my head with kittens and vanilla pudding. Tell me, how do you do it? What? Always manage to pull yourself together. Focus. No matter what's happening. Hmm. Don't know about vanilla pudding. Could work. But nothing picks me up like Lambert's famous homebrew. Suppose it can't kill me. Might as well try. Me. 
you. That strong. Maybe you want to try a different method. We've tried at least 20. Wouldn't let it worry you. Not like you need to excel at everything. You're great with a sword, an excellent archer. Leave the magic to mages. Yeah. Pull me another. Get up. We must go. I've saddled the horses. Siri, it's the crack of dawn. Where do you want to go? To Velen. Bald Mountain. But a few days till the Witch's Sabbath. And guess who's the guest of honor? Dunno. Enlighten me. Imlarith. We'll have no better chance to get him. Where do you get this idea? What's gotten into you? I must avenge Vesemir. The Sabbath. It's the perfect opportunity. Imlarith will be drunk among his cohorts, caught up in the revelry. He'll not expect the blow. Siri, sure you know what you're getting into? Yes, and I must do this. Come, we shall talk on the way. Lead on. Ready? Let's go. After the Battle of Kaer Morhen, the defenders licked their wounds and mourned their losses, save Ciri who began to plan her revenge. She woke Geralt one night and urged him to travel with her to Velen, to the top of Bald Mountain, where oh she knew she'd find Imlarith. She had decided he had to die. The men at Crow's Perch, they spoke of this place. Ard Serbin, home of the Ladies of the Wood. The peasants feared coming here, and the barons thought the Ladies of the Wood a terrifying tale for naughty children. Incidentally, I wonder how the Baron is. Ventured into the swamp to look for his wife. No idea if he ever found her. A true shame. Let's get this done. We must reach the peak. We'll find Imlarith there. The peasant folk of Velen call this night the Feast of Gifts. I've no idea why. Find a way to the mountain summit. Look at these two together. I love this. Back at last, eh? Avalach claims vanity is Imlarith's greatest weakness. Vanity? Any foe he faces, he strives to impress. The other one, Caranthir, is said to be secretive and pragmatic. Hardly surprising, given he was Avalog's student. Blood Bald Mountain. I thought I said Blood Mountain, Bald Mountain. Should I shoot? I wouldn't. If I were you. 
Let them approach. But... They've come for the feast. Wouldn't do to cast them out. Didn't come to celebrate. We need to get to the top of the mountain. The gate is shut. You'll not pass. But we fire us down that away with food and drink aplenty. Sit down beside one, and perhaps this year the ladies will descend. Give us the privilege of seeing them. We thank you for the invitation. Be glad to sit down, right? Speak for yourself. Come with me. This celebration, what's it about? What do you need to know, Wanderer? No need for anger. The White Ones serve the ladies as we do now. We send them gifts all year long. And on this night, they repay us with their blessing. I met one of your gifts to the crones. Snivelling, scared to death and about eight years old. Stay calm. Your children. Why do the ladies need them? We know not and never ask. You don't know? Then let me tell you. Tell us instead what a peasant, his own young and starving, is to do with a wandering war orphan. You're not from here. Don't judge us by others' laws. Said the ladies bestow blessings on you. Aye, for our lives turn thus. First a summer of labour neath the hot sun, then autumn rains, then a winter of death. Then we await spring, when all that is dead is born anew, and from our blood and sweat the oak bears acorns, at times few, at times a handful. What do you do with the acorns? The Velen elders gather, hold council, some favor grinding them to spread on the fields for a rich harvest. Others want them given to a cunning woman who'd make medicine for consumption. A handful of enchanted acorns is enough for all Velen. Tis never enough. Heard enough about this. We've got other questions. Mentioned a gate, said we wouldn't pass. Only the Chosen visit the ladies. Every year, young lads and lasses climb the mount, but never more than three. Let me guess, the young lads and lasses don't return. No, they return happy and radiant. But rare is the one who then stays in Velen. Off they go to seek fortune in the wider world. Ladies of the wood visit you? If they favor us. My father told me they descended once. Passed from fire to fire, listening to hopes and grievances. So each year, we wait for them to walk amongst us once more. Haven't done it in a long time, then. No point waiting to see if we'll get lucky. Yeah, we gotta try to reach the peak. We should be going. Eager to see the ladies. I share your yearning. We're afire with yearning. Come, Geralt. We must get there before daybreak. Go to the tent and stand before Thecla. She's the one who decides who's worthy to face the ladies. Already. That's him. He can Talk to never know. Bell Thecla, to give her to climb the mountain. Hell we will. To ensure things that it's one true use. The grandmother said they came down the mouth just a few days. Good ladies, merciful ladies. My grandson, give him out. He works. Look, a child. No, a godling. I know him. Name's Johnny. Johnny! Well, old B, you're back. Uh, and I see you found your lass. I'm Johnny. 
We've had the pleasure already. A bit one-sided, though, it was. See, I saw you running. You're back to me, as I was <laughs> having the pleasure of... Oh, tis a long story. They call me Siri. Nice to meet you. How are things, Johnny? Health's good, so no complaints. What brings you here? We gotta climb the mountain. Can you help? I'd rather try to dissuade you, but I'm certain that would be in vain. The lass, she is stubborn as you. Even more so. Figured as much. <gasps> Path to the peak starts there, past the gate. But only old Thekla's got the key, so since you shan't ever get it, you best turn back now. Gotta get to the summit. Simple as that. It's Thekla you'll need to convince. She's blind as your bum, but she won't be fooled. We shan't try to trick her. She sits in that tent over yonder. I wish you luck, and do hope we meet again, someday. Ah, uh, like Johnny. Behind her. It's not ready. You've got to wait. I'll not come this way. It's clearing up. Mm. Who's that? Well. Come on, come closer, girl. Aye. What's she like? Narrow hips, sparkly eyes, a striking feisty lass. Never had a man. <sighs> Never mind. Got me answer. I choose you, girl. This night you shall see the ladies. If she goes up the mountain, I go with her. <laughs> what else has the cat dragged in? It's grey and veiny, got a scar, and eyes like a viper. Aye. Stinks of clotted blood and corpses. Plus it's old and infertile. I reject ye, freak. The girl will ascend alone. I'm going with her. <laughs> He's fire in his gut. What do you see? He's determined. He loves the girl, but he seeks to hide it from us. Perhaps I was mistaken. Perhaps there's life in him yet. By ancient right you may appeal my choice, but to do so you must best the challenge. I accept the challenge. <laughs> Come. Are you fucking kidding me? You want, you want me to jump? Look this over. A coin from days of yore. Falker burns on its reverse, so they call it the Defiers Auron. Now, bring me the coin. Are you? Something's afoot. aren't attacking me. The drowners. Just wonderful.
I was beginning to worry. Something's Come, afoot. let's get the key. Something's They're not. back. What do you want? Got that coin you tossed in the lake. It reeks of sludge. Nothing I can do about that. So, gonna keep your word? I always do, my boy. Show the coin to the gatekeeper past the threshold. He'll know its meaning. Mariko will open the gate for ye. Now go! That went smoothly. Weren't the one to do the diving in that cave. Stop one. You're a witcher. You've dived in murkier waters. Yeah, I have to tell you about the time I hunted a zoo. Geralt? Geralt? Hmm. What's your name, girl? What's yours? <clears throat> your name don't matter. Atop the peak, you'll lose it and get another. You may go. And you? I passed the trial. Here's proof. Recognize it? The Defiers, Oren. A death sentence. We've no time to lose. I'll tend to Imlirith, you take the crones. Avalarch said they dwell below the oak, among its roots. No chance. I'm going after Imlirith. <sighs> Fine, let's play for it. Rock, paper, scissors. Really? Serious? Damn it! Two out of three! Out of the question. I'll climb the mountain, you face the crones. Hardly a challenge. They're extremely dangerous. Be careful. You too. Oh. 
Oh, am I Siri now? I must get down there. Oh, I am. I'm Siri. Oh, hell. I guess I must jump. God damn. Okay, cool. of love and knew no bitterness. Oh. Yum, yum. Bitches. Oh, they're ugly. Welcome, child of the Elder Blood. We knew you would return. Your taste lingers on our tongues. You've talked enough. Naughty, naughty girl! at the summit. Gotta be. Medallion's humming. 
place of power it's gotta be. Sisters said you would come. They saw you arrive in the water's surface. They did not see the girl. But she is with you, is she not? I'm here alone. A lie which will change nothing. First you, then her. Okay. You gotta dodge him. Some good hits now, guys. Well, how long are you gonna make me wait?
Drop the shield, I see. Oh, okay. You to fight like this. The Witcher you slew. We did it. Barely. How'd it go down there? I slew only two of the crones. The third fled, with Vesemir's medallion. My sole memento. You avenged Vesemir. Avalark claims vengeance is only ever satisfying when served cold. He's wrong. Now to find Eredin and kill him. An Orin for your thoughts? Wondering what to tell Yennefer when we get to Novigrad. Tell her the truth. Always. I wonder if Triss and Yennefer have found the sorceresses at the lodge. We ought to rejoin them. Yeah, let's get going. Thank you. For coming with me. Come here. <laughs> Let's go. He's dead. The oak, the crones. I fear that was your last feast. What of our acorns?
Don't know, don't care. You must learn to live without them. This is no longer no man's land. It's no longer the lady's land. It's all yours. But what are we to do? Come, Geralt. It's time. Manage on your own. It's changed a bit since I last left. Radovid's growing bolder. They say whoever takes Novigrad will take the north. A free city full of riches, tempting prize. Some tankards with guests. Geralt! Siri! When I learned Geralt had found you. Glad to see you in one piece too, Dandelion. Where have you two been? Just finished hunting down the crones of Velen and a general of the Wild Hunt. Well, you've had a busy morning then, haven't you? In fact, you look terrible. Like you could really use some rest. Gladly take some. Point me to a room. Of course. Come on, little swallow. I'll take you. Let's meet later, Geralt. I've a little matter to resolve. I'll freshen up, then await you in the square in Gildorf. Right. Anyone here besides us? Lodge of sorceresses. Triss and Yen were supposed to gather the remnants. They're working on it. Triss is upstairs, waiting for you. Yennefer's gone to crippled Kate's. Yen? At that portside dive? Why? Didn't inform me. Imagine that. Ah, and that elf of yours moved into the ruby suite. Told me to tell you he's waiting, too. Gave him your best room? He didn't exactly ask. I prepared another room for him, but he blew past me and locked himself in the ruby. Hasn't peeked out since. Barely eats, drinks only water, and the only thing I've heard from him is, I wish to know when Gwynblade and Zeriel arrive. Thanks. Looks like I'll have my hands full. Dandy, dandy. The ladies find me handy. Radovidi Novigrad? That's just fine with me. More soldiers, more work. Okay, guys. Isn't quiet, girl, baby. 